Hey guys, Tom from Lush Tyler here. Today I want to talk about the many ways you can make money with a pickup truck. I'm only going to specifically focus on pickup trucks. I did create a post and a video in the past on making money with your car, which there are a lot of ways, but there are other ways you can make money if you have a truck because you have more space, as you can imagine. So in this video, I wanted to mention a couple websites and apps that you can sign up for. They work a lot like Uber and DoorDash and such. I'll explain how each one works. As always, I'm honest, I'm straight to the point. I only recommend what I feel is reputable. As always, I like to get straight to it. So that being said, let's begin. Okay, so the first one I'm gonna mention here is GoShare. This one works a lot like Uber. You'll log into the app, you'll work whenever you're pleased. And the app allows you to browse current project requests and accept the ones you're interested in. So you're never forced to take a job. You can work whenever you please. So people need help moving, um, something from one place to another. So for example, if you look on their main page here, they have a pickup truck. If they may need to move a piece of furniture, but maybe you own a cargo van or a bigger box truck, then you can move more boxes, such as a one to two bedroom apartment and so forth. So according to the frequently asked questions, GoShare notes that you can make anywhere from 47 to $71 an hour, all depending on what type of vehicle you own. And you can see all the averages on the official website. And the great thing about this is the app is that you don't have to do anything but accept the projects. You don't have to find the customer. So they do all the work for you. If you're interested in working with them, they don't accept everyone that applies. As stated on their website, these are the minimum requirements as followed. You need to be at least 18 years old. Your vehicle should pass a vehicle inspection. You need to pass background check and you need to have an Android or iPhone capable of running the app. Also, you need a checking account, speak English, and have a valid driver's license to meet the state insurance requirements. If you want to work whenever you want, you have the truck, goshare.co. I'll link in the description. is a great starting point. Check out the website. It's very really highly uh, reviewed for both customers and drivers. It's a reputable company. So it's one, again, if you have a bigger truck, cargo van, box truck, if you want, want to move things around in your town. This is another option I like it. It's on Craigslist. What you're going to want to do is just go to this gig section. And when you do, You'll click on it and you'll type in pickup truck. And as I type in pickup truck here, you're gonna see that you could find a couple companies in your area because every city varies on the companies that are offered. So for example, I did mention GoShare, so I live in the Arizona area and GoShare is here, but also you could see that there's other companies such as this frat company, but then we could scroll down. So for example, they, this person needs someone to pick up gravel on Monday. If you're willing to go pick up gravel, it might be worth your time. There's um, a trash valet here. It says $800 a month, two hours a night with your truck. Uh, then there's one for paid survey. This has nothing to do with driving around, but they want truck owners. And as you can see, construction delivery, these jobs will always refresh. There's not a lot at the moment, maybe 10, 15. But depending on the city, if you live in a larger city like Phoenix here, you're going to see a lot of options. But go ahead and click on one of these. So, for example, if you clicked on the Trash Butler, you could read a little bit more about it. I'll pay up to $800 a month. You'll text this person or you can apply here. And then just read the key responsibilities. Maybe do a little bit of research on the company before you apply. A lot of times, it'll even say no experience is required. So, check it out and see if you can find anything of interest. It's a great way to make money on the side, usually on your own time. This one's a little different. You can use this website for any vehicle, not just a truck. But the thing I like about this website is that a lot of people need your truck to maybe move something bigger and they don't have a truck at home. So this is where you can come in. So basically it's Turo, T-U-R-O, and you can make an average of $706 a month. Again, this is a rental marking place. So it's kind of like a Airbnb, but for cars. And what you're gonna do is as long as you don't mind, you're gonna list your truck for free. It takes only a couple minutes. You get to set the price and the rules. So you can say no pets. You can even say, I don't want you hauling anything. It's whatever you wanna say. You get to choose where you wanna meet, how you wanna meet someone, they can come to your house, so forth. And then you earn anywhere from 60 to 85% of that trip price. Now, you're covered $750,000 in case of liability from their insurance. And there's also damage protection plans that you could choose from so in case your car does get damaged there can be uh insurance to cover you on that on that regard this is one of the biggest communities online 24 7 customer support and they do have very good reviews if you review online just sign up and check out what people are saying as well as what kind of cars are in the in the area with the truck i've looked and you can make anywhere from 40 to 80 dollars a day but this is going to greatly depend on what you're offering where you live even if it's 40 dollars a day that's still 1200 dollars a month if you're able to rent it out every day of the month that might be rare but again sign up and check out your database to see what can happen you ships another one here this one's more geared towards 18 wheelers as they're shipping bigger items across the united states but if you don't mind shipping something out of state or even within the state, you can create a profile and then basically what you're gonna to wanna to do is sell yourself. So in this case, they're gonna say you wanna add a photo, your experience, 
And then they do re recommend that you have the proper authority ins insurance and they'll show that you're a safer watch monitor, which gives you more credibility when you've been on the projects. And what you can do before you even sign up is go to the Find Shipments tab. And you can just go to the side here. And I just, for my example, I put nothing more than 150 pounds for a pickup truck and I can scroll through here. And what I see is there's a lot of pets, but this mattress maybe, um, I mean, the offer's low on that, but there's some you might find that might be worth your while. You can quote, so you get to make the decision. So you're gonna say, I can do this for X amount of dollars. So even if you were, say, going to Colorado and you were going there anyways and that person wanted a mattress, you could say, hey, I'll do it for gas money, 200 bucks, or do, do it for more. And if they accept your bid, you work out the details as in when to pick it up. But usually they give you a time frame. So for example, this person wants it delivered anywhere, anywhere between the seventh and the 12th so it's your job to go in there make sure you have a profile that sells yourself and then put in a bid and then see if anyone accepts it once you maybe get good enough you could time multiple jobs and make it worth your while but again this one takes a little more work and if you're going to need the insurance and whatnot to make yourself credible but it is one to consider if you have a pickup truck or a bigger truck for that matter and you want to make money TaskRab, it's another one I like, and this is more of a handyman service, and they have a lot of popular projects, and some of it does deal with uh, assembling furniture, maybe mounting a TV, but what you're going to find is if you have a truck, you could help move boxes, you can uh, do delivery jobs, and the average project you could see with the truck is $40 to $115. What I do is recommend is that you sign up, and then you can create your own profile where people can reach out to you. So for example, this person has a profile. They've completed over 292 tasks. They say they'll deliver for $30 an hour, they'll move $72 an hour, and so forth. So you can create that profile, and then you can bid on jobs. Check out the uh, availability, because they're not in every city. It's on the main page. Again, a link in the description. And just go down to the bottom and check out. So for example, I live in Arizona and they have two city options. They may not be in your area, but if they are, sign up and check it out. It's a great way to make that money and average anywhere from $40 to $115 per project. Again, you get to see the project and if you want to bid on it, go for it. And the more reviews you get, the more popular you can become because then those reviews kind of vet for your reputation. Just a few of the many ways that you can make money in your pickup truck. Go to that link in the description. I found many other ways you can make money from plowing snows or removing junk. Just check, check out the list. There's a lot of options. So whether you want to start your business or you just want to download an app, it's just really up to you to decide what's best for your situation as I don't really know what kind of money you're looking to make. But if you want to make thousands, start a business. But if you have a few hundred, then download an app like the Go, Go Share or hop on TaskRabbit. So for now, that's going to do it. Check out the many options and post videos that I've done on LushDollar.com in the video archive. I continue to add as much as I can. Like, comment, subscribe, whatever you want to do. It all helps me out. That's going to do it for now. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.